Hey guys, welcome to another video. Yo, how are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. So in today's video, I'm going to be picking my November TBR. Guys, this year is just flying away. Like, what the flip? We just started and now we are in November already. Imagine. Anyway, in today's video, I'm going to be using my TBR jar. Actually, let's just call it TBR plate because I don't have the jar, but... You, you, you understand why actually i didn't explain why but i'm not ready to explain why <laughs> okay so um i already filmed a tbr video for november on my asmr channel where i unboxed i had just four books left the wrapped books that my brothers did and all that i had just four books left and i wanted to actually open them up so i did that on my asmr channel so, um they yeah, are just four books because that's all if you're interested in that you can go check it out but if the prompts prompt me to pick one of those ones i think i will just smartly choose it and if all the four prompts i pick prompts for all of them then i'll add two more prompts to make my books six but well i plan to pick just four books okay so yeah so let's get straight into the video i'm so excited it's been long i did this <laughs> okay 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 so Let's pick this one. What does it say? A book that matches your nails. Ah, oh my God, I just got my nails done yesterday. I'm so excited. Look at look at it. I was not sure what color I wanted. So if I was like, okay, pick all this. And I just picked all the four colors. Like, do you see? It's so cute. Okay, so matches my nails. Let's back to the topic. Oh. Ah, okay. So one of the prompts actually prompts for one of the choices i made for my asmr video and that's this one do you guys see the colors so there's red there's red there's like a mustard kind of yellow there is that on my nails and there's like wine no wine but yeah it matches my nails doesn't it like it goes maybe in another life also actually matches my nails uh, kind of yes, it does matches my nails <clears throat> Maybe in another life Ah, uh, Okay, let's go with the true love experiment first for now first. Okay, so I'm going to be taking The true love experiment by Christina Lauren. I love Christina Lauren. Okay Yeah Oh my god, I feel like I'm going to go breeze through this. It's been a while. I've been so busy sick and everything I've not been reading but Yeah, yeah Another prompt. With a number in the title. With a number in the title. I have Punk 57 by Penelope Douglas. I've not read any book by this author. And I have like, I think two of our books. So this would be nice. It says we were perfect together until we met. Ah. That sounds dramatic. <laughs> and then my second option would be this this storm. <laughs> Binding 13 by Chloe Walsh. Honestly, I would have loved to pick this one. But it's so chunky and it's a series. And I just started Zodiac Academy. And I'm afraid that I would want to... I would be in the middle of a lot of series. And this one, I have the complete series actually. So... Let me just go with Pump 57 because of the size. I'm so sorry, but promise, I know you understand. I know, I know. I'll get into Binding 13 one day. And if another prompt actually prompts, maybe I'll pick it. So we're going with Punk 57. So we have two choices. Okay, okay. Let's do one more. Uh. Uh, this one was calling to me. What does it say? A thriller or mystery? Hmm. Honestly, am I in the mood for that? <laughs> I'm actually not in the mood for any thrillers. I don't know why. Maybe because I feel like once I read a thriller, I know I'm taking it off my shelf. <gasps> okay, so I have two thrillers here looking at me. The Beautiful Dead by Belinda Boa. This one. Um, I think it's a thriller or a mystery. I'm not sure. It says they wanted the same things. Death and an audience. Oh, yikes. 
Eve Singer makes a living from death as a TV crime reporter. She'll go to any length to get the latest scoop. But when a twisted serial killer starts using her to gain the publicity he craves, Eve must decide how far she's willing to go and how close she'll let him get. Oh. And then this is my second option, the secretary. Now, um, she knows all your secrets, but will she keep them? Okay. Oh my God. These are the two thrillers that are calling to me right now. But huh, let me look at her. Um, okay, they don't look like they'll be difficult, but... He might kill her she might let him okay i'm going to go with the beautiful dead because i'm actually curious yes let's go with that <laughs> oh my god oh my god okay i'm so scared <laughs> okay this one ah please be something exciting i want to pick iron flame a book with food on the cover food ha huh. food food <laughs> let's go through this shelf um guys after going through my bookshelf thoroughly <laughs> i found some with book with food on the cover i found this one all the fields by olivia dade there's a popcorn on the cover here do you see yes then i also found love and gelato ice cream cones that's food we eat ice cream and then I also found Once Upon a Broken Art by Stephanie Garber. Honestly, these three books, I am so confused because I want to read Caraval first before reading this. And of course, this already cancels this out. Love and Gelato feels like it's a summer read. And you guys already know we are in winter, autumn, even though in my country we are still, it's just rainy season. But so this already cancels out and all the feels i'm not sure if this is a book one or a book two so i'm going to check because i think there was a book before this maybe spoiler alert or something i'm not so sure goodreads because goodreads always knows all the feels what's wrong with goodreads lately like nothing is working Ugh, i can't find any book oh okay okay yeah so like i said it's actually a book two in the spoiler alert series so it also cancels out so i think i'm just going to actually look for another prompt <clears throat> let's do this one that is like oh my god there are two okay this one <laughs> your choice <laughs> my choice i've been waiting to pick this prompt for years now Oh my god, finally, I can pick what I want, what I want. <laughs> okay, now that I can pick what I want, now I don't know what I want. <laughs> uh, okay, this is, this is crazy. You guys actually saw this coming, right? Of course, I have fame. I can't wait to get into this. I read Fourth Ring and I've been crazy. Like, I was hyper, so of course... Iron Flames next. Yes, I've picked four books now with the prompt. Oh uh, gosh, should I push it and pick one more? Uh, guys, you know that this is just options. These are just options. I don't necessarily have to read all the books I'm picking. Okay, let's just do one more. Let's just do one more. Uh, this one is here. Series you are in the middle of. Speak to me directly. I'm in the middle of it. <laughs> I was in the middle of I am uh, uh, fourth wing. I was also in the middle of um oh my god, Shatter Me. But I think I should read Shatter Me before the month ends, which it ends next week. So I think I should be able to do that. What other series am I in the middle of? I'm actually in the mid of middle of the Chestnut Spring series. I have only read Flawless, and that means I'm supposed to pick up the next book, which is heartless and it's a small town romance mm, i'm also in the middle of the naturals by jennifer limbans <sighs> guys i have read killer instincts and the naturals but i don't know i'm still deciding 
I'm still trying to decide whether to buy the remaining two books or not because I don't have them physically and it's like a mystery thriller kind of vibe. Yeah, the book is very good, but at the same time, I, I'm thinking it would be better for me to continue on my Kindle. I'm also in the middle of... Oh, I've not even started Six of Crows. Why am I in the middle of that? I'm in the middle of the Never After series and Wretched is the next book. I've read Oaked and Scarred, so wretched so i think i will just pick wretched because it's a dark romance and it's been a while i read any dark romance so this is the third book i want to get into it i don't know what story this one actually follows because i know scarred follows um the lion king Ooked follows peter pan kind of retelling kind of vibe i don't know what this one does because wretched I don't know honestly i don't know but uh, i'm eager to find out so these are the five books i'm going to be reading in november actually it's more than five because i have three more that i picked from my other tbr that i am going to add to this and let me just tell you what they are so i have memoirs of a geisha queenie wahala by nikki may this i'm excited for then the other ones i picked in this video which are all these so thank you so much for watching let me know which one is on your own tbr for this month i would really really love to know and i'll see you guys in my next video Jesus. says hey this is